it's time to blow this scene. Get everybody in the stuff together. Okay, three, two, one, let's jam. Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Anime Contest of the Ages. I am your host, John. As you can imagine, we're going to be having some fantastic anime sent to us soon. Anyone out there has the power to make a good anime, so send it all of your anime now. Kirby, did you just hear that? Yeah, they're hosting an anime contest, young chap. And we will get first place! Wait, you're actually going to make an anime series for it? Of course! I've been inspired to make my own anime series for a long time. Watching shows like Sailor Moon and Neon Genesis Evangelion gave me that inspiration. So now that there's an anime contest going on, I think now's the perfect time to make this anime become a reality. What's going on? Mara Bulbum's making his own anime series, young chap. Really? Wow. Do you need any help for it? Help would be greatly appreciated. In fact, I'll allow the whole village to come and help. So what should this anime be about? I'm thinking... I've got it! What is it? I hope it's a good idea. So I'm just relaxing, right? And all of a sudden, I get transported to another dimension. Whoa! Another dimension? This has so much potential! So what dimension do you get transported to, young chap? To the world where Sailor Moon takes place in, and I get married to my way through Sailor Venus. That kind of sucks. What? But Minako is so beautiful, she can make anything glorious. It's not that, it, it's just this sounds more like a bad fan fiction than an anime series. Does anyone else have any good ideas? I've got one. So basically, it should go like this, young chap. Whoa, hold on a second. The idea you've said is basically the show we're already in. Is it? It's very, very similar. In fact, that song has already been used in a previous episode. Alright, I forgot, young chap. I've got it! Really? Yes, this will be so good. Well then, let's hear this great idea of yours. Here it is. Space. Western. Olimar. Space. Western. Olimar? What's it about? Okay, so basically, this is the plot. It's 2095, right? Either it's real or it's a dream, nothing that is in between and all that, right? Well, at this point, most life forms in the galaxy, such as Pitman, Bulbums, and Hobbitations, are able to colonise other planets and live on those. They can also colonise moons as well. Amid a rising crime rate, Hockertape Flight sets up a legalised contract system in which registered bounty hunters, otherwise known as the Hockertations, chase criminals and bring them alive in return for a reward. The series protagonists are bounty hunters working for Hockertape Flight, Olimar and Louie. And that is how it will turn out. That sounds like the greatest idea for an anime I've ever heard. Now there's an anime I'll actually like, young chaps. I'm glad you all liked it. So without further ado, let's begin the production of Space Western Olimar. The day has finally come. Let's see what masterpiece we've created.
this scene. Get everybody in the stuff together. Okay, three, two, one, it's jam. Hey, Louie. It's ready. I'm just about done myself. What's cooking? Special, King Jowersi. Beef with bell peppers. Cyber Captain Illimer. That is our next target. He's a high end of the syndicate that deals all around the asteroids. He's always coming. About this King Jowersi. This guy's name is Cyber Captain Illimer. Weren't you listening to me? You don't call a meatless beef with bell peppers beef with bell peppers. Do you? Yes, you do. No, you don't. You do when you're broke. What happened to the 1 million pocos we got as bounty from that last guy? The repair bill the plane you wrecked and the repair bill for the shop you trashed and the medical bill for the cop you injured killed. All. The dump. Three days ago. There was a shootout between his group and an enemy syndicate. He killed his own men, and took off. They say he's hiding with his woman on the Pikmin planet. That's a place for nobodies to go. Despite being a nobody, he's worth 2.5 million. Don't feel like it. Tijuana. The beef there is really tasty. Attention, please. We will soon arrive at the gate. We look forward to serving you again. Please line up single file at the toll booth after clearing the gate. Please pass by after switching the credit sensors to debit mode. Hello, who is this? This is Mayor Rabal Ball from Trooper Village. How are you doing? Not so good, I'm afraid. What's wrong? There's some criminals causing havoc in Trooper Village. Criminals? We'll be right over. Alright Louie, we've got a job to do. What's happened? Apparently some criminals are causing havoc in Trooper Village. That's not good. It's our duty to stop them before it's too late. Come on Louie, let's go. Right away. Whatever happens, happens. Give me all the gold coins. And make it snappy. Freeze. Your criminal days are over, Wario brother. Time to end this. Thank you, UFO Saving Lava Village. Captains. You are welcome. See you in space, Captain. Right then, shall we continue with cooking our beef? We sure can. That's the best thing I've ever seen, young chaps.
We've certainly done a good job. I definitely agree. We've created a masterpiece. Let's see what Pikmin's Got Talent think about it. Hello everybody, and welcome back to the Anime Contest of the Ages. We are in Trooper Village to meet Mera Bulbob, the creator of Space Western Olimar, one of the anime that was sent to us. Did you all like it? Mera Bulbob, you'll be pleased to know that Space Western Olimar won the contest! Holy Bulbobs, that's great! Not only that, but we pitched the pilot to Space Western Olimar to Hideki Anno, and he said that you've been accepted to make Space Western Olimar as an actual anime series. That's amazing! Thank you so much. I can't believe Hideki Anno might not say. You're welcome. As you can already tell, I think your anime series is great. Well, let's see what the judges have to say. First, let's hear Kirby's opinion. Space Western Anime was the first anime I ever watched, and it blew me away. Very excellent work. Next, the yellow Pikmin who is going to rock. Wow. Now, let's see what Psyduck has to say. That was epic! It was the most epicest anime I have ever seen. I'm a weeboo anyway, but Space Western Army was so epically epic that my epic mind was so epically sealed from it. What an epic anime! There wasn't a single negative response, and rightfully so. Thank you so much for this anime, Mel Bubble. You won! Yay! Yay! This is Johnny, signing out. ちょっと泣けくには Keep it.